Hey, 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 it's Jacarius aka The Soap Ash Show, and I'm here to give you a review of who this week's episodes of General Hospital from March 11 to the 15th. So, bear with me and let's get this thing started. And on Monday's episode, Sonny tells that Sam that Jason is alive, at least. She knows that Jason is alive, so yeah. And I don't like the writer on Sam, so yeah. I don't like how they write it, Sam. Yeah. I just don't at this point, because now she blaming him for all them things now. And this is not Sam. Like, the Sam I remember, she is ride and die for Jason. And yeah, I just don't like this shit. I don't like it. And... I don't like Sam and Dante together. I'm sorry. I just don't. Not at all. And Carly refused to believe that Jason shot at Sonny or Dante. And yeah. It just, whew. Wow. I just came with these storylines. But they doing the Jason storyline slowly. Like slow burn. Which I did not mind, but it's better than his 2017 return. Like, Jason has been presumed dead but like, two damn times. And this is, yeah, this is, like, the second time he came back from the dead. So, yeah, pretty much it. And then, Sonny is in the shock of his life that Carly reveals that Jason is back. Oh, yeah. Pretty much. Then we see Jagger and Anna um, talking about all these things. They may not agree with each other, but they are pursuing something in coming, like in goals. So, yeah. Just put Spandelli and Massey back together. Just put them back together. And I need for Sasha and Cody off my screen. I, at this point, I need Sasha and Coda off my screen. And that's all I want to say about Monday's episode. And on Tuesday's episode, ja- Jason gets help from Danny. And yeah. It's good to ha- it's good to see Jason have a scenes with one of his sons on there. It's good to see him sharing scenes with Danny. So yeah. And... I really not need Michael in there in the same place. So, yeah. It's good to see Danny help his dad out. So, yeah. That's it on there. Then Drew breaks up with Carly. It's about time they did that. It's about time they really did that for sure. Because I'm so happy that Drew and Carly are through. They are through. And, and Drew, he's really just like a replacement for Jason. I will say he's just another replacement for Jason. But I'm glad they are through. They are through. They are through. I'm happy. But he ain't had to call Carly like that. I may not be a Carly fan, but dang, he didn't have to be that harsh. And this is why I say Drew is just another Ryan Lavery. I would say. He just another Ryan Lavery. So, yeah. And at this point, I want Drew to be gone. Like, after Billy Miller had let the road, Drew should have stayed dead. And I meant He should have stayed dead. So, yeah. And then Sam finds himself being washed with so much emotions. And, yeah. I just don't. I don't like how they write Sam. So, yeah. And then we see if Finn gets a closer look at Heather. <laughs> and all I got to say is, there's like, also, like, I just want Finn. I don't want the actor to lose that job, but I'm, I'm just tired of him. I'm really tired of him. So, yeah. And then Natalie... Uh, try to do what's best for her daughter and her daughter loves Christina and yeah I don't I don't like Blaze and Christina together but 
I feel like Latoya is just, yeah. I like Eva LaRue is a good actress, but I'm just not liking Latoya at all. But they could have brought Eva LaRue back as Mar- Maria. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, or something. But I'm just tired of these newbies taking over General Hospital. This is not General Hospital. So, yeah. In our Wednesday's episode, we see Danny brings Michael to help Jason. And this is, I say this like er, a bit earlier, but I just like, Michael did not need to be in this scene. I'm sorry, he did not need to be in this scene at all. But yeah. And as I mentioned on Wednesday, on Tuesday's episode, Drew. The end things with Carly. So, yeah. Drew the ends things with Carly. So, yeah. He ends things with her. But, yeah. This is like Tuesday slash Wednesday's episode. So, yeah. But, then we see Michael. Uh. <laughs> get shocked about Jason being alive. So, yeah. So, pretty much, then Sonny is saying he wants to be glad that Jason is back, but he wonder if Jason has changed. I said, damn. <laughs> so, yeah. Then, Kurt, then Selena, will, Selena will tell him, Curtis and Marsha, that uh, Jason is alive. And why they have to know about this? I don't know. So, yeah, then, oh, Jordan, I may not be a Jordan fan, but she, Jordan deserves better, and don't put her with Drew, please do not put her with Drew, do not put her with Drew at all, so, yeah, then on Thursday episode, we see Jason has been working as a military cons- contractor under the duration of Jagger. What Jagger has to do with it? He was like, he has something to do with Jason being presumed dead. God damn. God damn it. I knew, I knew I could not trust Jagger. God dang. Why Jagger? Why Jagger? Why Jagger? So, yeah. Then Jason. Jason tell us where he has been since that tunnel collapse. And, yeah. That was some good. That was some good scenes, I will say. It was really some good scenes. So, yeah. And then. Then then Lois checks in on Sonny. About him, about everything. So yeah, she's chasing on Sunny. Uh, yeah. But all I gotta say is Lois Cirillo deserves better writing. So yeah, since this Rain of Sulfur has returned, I ain't like how they writing Lois Cirillo. Chris and Dan, I'm glad y'all gone. I'm glad y'all gone so y'all can fix this ish. Me, <laughs> so so y'all can't fix this at all. I'm glad y'all is gone. So yeah, we gonna talk. We gonna get. I'm gonna get to the Corte and Patrick part on Friday's episode. So yeah. Then John was no friend of Sonny. So who will call her at when the feds ask her for help? Yeah, I don't have nothing to say about that scene. But let's get into Friday's episode. And I'm not talking about the Molly, Molly and Anna scenes on Thursday's episode. Nothing to say about that. But let's get into Friday's episode. Heather's about to get a bit of met. So, yeah. Heather. Um, wow. <laughs> it's just like. Day is giving Heather more storylines. 
than anybody else, I would say. She is a recurrent uh, character. And that's just like... Why we got to see Hella? Hella? But Hella... I mean, Ellie Mills is doing a great job. I would say. She is doing a great job, I would say. So, yeah. But Hella... It's crazy. And Ali Mills is killing their role once again. So, yeah. And then we see <laughs> Mina getting on Alexis nerves. And, yeah. <laughs> and pretty much there. And I forgot to say, this is the first episode with Patrick and Cortez writing. This is officially the first episode with the new head writers take over because... McKinney has been has been on General Hospital for a, a long time, but he did, but he came back. But Cortez has been on like the run the writing. She has been on General Hospital for a long time. She should know the history, and and Patrick do do too. But I'm glad Chris is down or gone. But so far the like writing is a bit, yeah. There. So let's get back to Diane talking to Alyssa about a proposal. We see Diane uh, approach the Alyssa to get uh, her law, lawyer license back as she been disbarred for the second time for lying about not sleeping with uh, Neil. So yeah, that's it on this scenes. Then Jocelyn trying not to let um this leaves. Not just don't care for Jocelyn, that's like this. I'm sorry. And then we see Jason gets wind cranked with his loves once. And yeah. Did it have no Friday this episode? But no. yeah, scratch that but then we see Nina is about to humiliate Gregory and then got some like yeah by his Alzheimer's so yeah and at this point I'm just so through with all the stories from General Hospital and y'all need to fix up some mess up McCanny and Corte fix fix it just fix it all so yeah but that's it on to that oh, this week's episode of General Hospital. So please like, comment, and subscribe. But don't, don't forget to hit that bell. Follow me on IG at the Soap at the Show and Team John DeMera for more all these things. And also follow me on Twitter at Soap at the Show Team John 99 and Day Stand 99 for more all these things. And also follow Janelle Forever. And also follow me on Threads at at the Soap at the Show. And also follow, subscribe to my main channel at whew, Jakari Stuss Things. So, yeah. But thank you for watching and have a wonderful day and night. Well, yeah, once again, and bye.